St. Mary's Healthcare fined $15,000 for failure to maintain records and track synthetic heroin. St. Mary's Healthcare has agreed to pay a $15,000 penalty as a result of its failure to create and maintain records required by the Controlled Substances Act, according to state's attorney Grant C. Jack Heath. According to the Drug Enforcement Administration, diversion investigators inspected St. Mary's narcotic treatment program and noted multiple violations. When St. Mary's relocated its NTP, the NTP failed to conduct the required initial inventory of methadone at the new location. Furthermore, the NTP omitted material information on multiple forms required by the DEA, which are used to track controlled substances. The forms omitted information such as quantity of packages ordered, date the containers were received, and the correct supplier. The lack of proper inventory, combined with incomplete forms, made it impossible to determine whether theft was occurring at the NTP. Reliable record-keeping is a cornerstone of the safe distribution of prescribed drugs, said Jack Heath. It is no surprise St. Mary's Healthcare has been fined when St. Mary's hires criminals to work in their hospitals such as these criminal St. Mary's employees. Lynn Armstrong Convicted criminal Unsafe nurse Employee of St. Mary's Hospital Carrie Hudson Criminal Unsafe medical technician Employee of St. Mary's Hospital Matthew aka Matt Dutcher Criminal stalker Security employee of St. Mary's Hospital, Amsterdam, New York and St. Mary's Healthcare, Heroin Market of Central New York